Look at that consistency, that creaminess. I may be a weirdo, but this is my year, yo. My life may be crazy, my lack of the lazy has let me do shit that I love on the daily. Daily. Good morning, vegan savages. My hair just don't wanna go down, they just go in whatever direction. You wanna hear a fun story? When I was a kid and that happened, what I did, I just took a scissors and cut them off. Problem solved, right? And I did it again and again and again. And next time, my mom got me to the hairdresser. She was like, I'm not gonna give your son a haircut. I don't wanna ruin my reputation. Your son has holes in his head. I was like, what are you talking about? She showed me a mirror. I was like, oh shit, I actually have holes in my head. I mean empty spots without hair because I just cut it off and then my mom was like please please we don't tell anyone where we went to and then I was like okay I don't do that again and I didn't and I just deal with that so I do the same now Good morning, already said that, just read my emails and one was really nice and helpful for my being savages so I don't want to withhold that information and they're back to trilling. I'm sorry. I hope this works. I saw today that you still did not get the aquafaba to work. My wife and I whipped up a batch this morning. See photo, which I show you in a sec. To our oatmeal. We got nice stiff peaks. Nice. It seems that you did not boil down the liquid enough. You need to reduce it by about half. I made a fresh batch tonight and it took about 40 minutes. 40 minutes? Aquafaba is no joke. Just take can chickpeas, I would recommend. Also, it has to be cold to whip. We used a hand mixer and it takes 5 to 10 minutes to get nice stiff peaks. Lastly, a pinch of cream of tartar. Dasha, what is tartar? So a cream of tartar, it's a powder that helps to hold things together. So they usually use it for to whip aquafaba or white uh, egg whites, you know, so it's... But what kind of powder? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Tata in German, it's also raw meat, so I'm confused. We also add a pinch of gua gum, but not essential to help it stiffen faster. Check out the pictures. Good luck and I love your vlogs. Well, most of them anyways. What is that supposed to mean? Check out those pictures. Look at that consistency, that creaminess. Oh, 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 goodness. But for the, anyways, I tried to find salt-free cans because when it's canned, then it was so easy. And this morning in my emails, I got an appointment for my DEXA scan on the 16th. So only four days before my competition, I will be excited how low my body fat percentage actually is. And I'm just... 12 days out. So now tunnel vision, the competition around the corner. Today, upper body training. There's no discussion anymore. How's your energy? No, we just do it. We just do what is required to do in order to be my best version and to rock the stage as good as I can. Be my best version. I just said that. Which classes should I rock on stage? These or these? What would you say, Dasha? I think this one. This one? Yeah. I think so too. I think these look cooler, but as you can see in the picture right there, sometimes you see the blue filter stuff and then they look blue and then they look kind of whack. So I don't know how it will look on stage. Will they look blue? If so, I don't like that, but they never look blue. So I think I rock those, but you let me know down below and I won't read any comments now because you said start a new format so I saved many good comments like I do daily and we keep them and later probably I do a separate video where I just answer comments you can sit back watch another video you don't even need to watch you can just listen to me we can interact you can comment there as well but here we focus on the vlog what I do and what is now going to the gym Dasha you pumped yeah training upper body me too she read my training guide in a matter of like you finished it already right yeah like my last page Good job! Is it good? Would yeah. you recommend it? Yeah, it's very good and a lot of information, a lot of good information, so I highly recommend it. So you now know how to make vegan games? Yeah. What's your discount code? Should we make a discount? That's too much work for my deficit. Let's just throw it down below. Support, go, it's just 19.95. For all the knowledge you need to build muscles, check out the link down below. I have a trailer video of what you can expect and many informations and even a look inside of the first 10 pages or so. So check it out, the V-Gains training guide. And also nutrition guide to know what to eat to 
and yeah, also awesome. my app and also my merch. I need more digital products and more products in general. What should we do next? I know what. Schmack testing because it's just so yummy. Uh, but we get Vivo Life da, 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 to the next level. And if you have any suggestions for future products I should do, like ebooks, maybe more about spirituality, my thoughts about it, like follow your highest excitement, what you put out, what you is what you get back, and all these universal laws which I applied for the last years and which helped me creating my dream reality, which seems so dreamlike and life is just amazing. If I should write it all down in a EO, maybe a video, I don't know. I'm thinking currently about like what next future digital product should I bring out. Let me know suggestions down below. Let's hit the chin. Honestly, one of the toughest trainings, energy-wise, but I did it completely, all out, hit my numbers. Because sometimes you just gotta do, do, do it. Just do it. Yes, hey. but I'm also stoked. Stoked and stoked. <laughs> stoked and stoked. Because we're gonna play World of Warcraft Classic now, right? Yeah. Bro, I honestly have cravings. I wanna play, and what is the difference? I spent like each day, yeah. half an hour or an hour, just watching like World of Warcraft Classic videos. Yeah. What is the difference if I actually use the time to play? Yeah, you're right. Let's play. Did I convince you? Mm -hmm. And I figured out what I wanna play. You ready? Tell me. DPS Paladin. What is the spec called? Rep reputation? Uh, no. Something similar. Rep something. I wanna play this because I've never done and paladins they're like so imba, so above the others and so cool like you're a superhero. Yeah. So what are you gonna play? Rope maybe? How you but you you played so much you played basically every class, right? Yeah. I just played it's a been interesting for you, but I just played hunter and druid and a bit of rogue. Um, and we need a healer, you know? The only thing is when I play Paladin, then we can only choose alliance in classic, right? Mm -hmm. But horde horde for life, horde of horde. <laughs> Anyways, I think on the Mac it just sucks. We would need a good computer. What am I doing here? I don't know. Tell me. I better don't tell it, right? <laughs> <laughs> better not. In support, Yoli's birthday gift. You got used to it, right? And um, not uh, actually, I'm using it all the time. Yes. Yeah. And is it sticking to the bottom? It is. So you need to clean it afterwards a lot. Yeah, but so this is just oats and apple and Philip cinnamon and cinnamon and Philip added more water Some because when he adds the protein, then it has the perfect texture. Yeah. What's your code? Code. Vegan sir. Code. Vegan sir. Yeah, of course, vegan sir. Vegan sir. Yeah. Ah, vanilla. There's no. Oh, you know when you're in a deficit, everything is so enhanced. Like the kitchen, everything smells so good. <laughs> this is pumpkin. Like pumpkin puree. Oh, what are you making, Yuli? Pumpkin cinnamon rolls. Can I see it? Well, those here. Nice. So stay tuned on Yuli's Insta, I guess. Hopefully. You make a recipe video. Oh, not video. Uh, recipe picture. picture. But not my recipe song. Okay, I, I gotta get out of this kitchen.
Say it again. I baked pumpkin and sweet potatoes, so... So what? So you can have it for lunch if what? you want. What do you mean? I'm on a meal plan. What is that? Porridge? Yeah. Oh, um, no, it's all yours. I stick to my stuff. I already tracked like in the vlog yesterday, so it's the same. So I don't need to calculate it in and make sure to eat my protein. And it's nice and easy and I have everything handy. Everything is on point. Just recorded, asked Nikos and got Dasha set on Final Cut and added all my motion templates and my effects, this and that. That was a hustle. That wasn't easy, but we made good progress. Because let me tell you, for daily vlogs and just a lot of quick content, you want to just edit quickly and efficiently, Final Cut is, in my opinion, so much faster and easier than Premiere, what she's used to. So, what do you say to Final Cut after working for two hours using it? Yeah, it's much easier and quicker than... And she's saying that after two hours. Usually then you're not used to it at all and you're like, what is that? I'm not used to it, I hate... Usually, that's me, when Instagram, where anything is doing updates and it's looking way different, I'm like, that is so ugly that I dislike it, but then you get used to it and it's often, not always, but often even better. So she's saying that it's even better after two hours, so trust me for quick content, but anyways, depends what you're doing on, but stuff that you wanna do quickly and also the rendering time, Final Cut is way faster than Premiere, but if you're doing cinematic documentary stuff, you have more options using Premiere, that's what I've heard, but most creators on YouTube, on social media are using Final Cut, but it's a personal preference, I would say. <sighs> what a weather. My plan was now to do a comment video, where I answer comments, but they're back to trilling, so I do something else now. The vlog is maybe a bit weird today because I got Yasha, Sasha, Dasha, sorry, my brain. Where is it? Also the ask Nikos, we're tough, but I have a good blame, the deficit. What do I do when the deficit isn't there anymore? Who can I blame? I'm a bit dumb, we all are. <laughs> Since it's Dasha's first day editing the vlog using Final Cut to not overflow her with shots, I'm gonna end the vlog. I don't even know what this vlog is about. I just got a lot of work done, edited the Ask Nikos, did this and that, future products, refilled my spices and did a mistake, accidentally put curry into cumin and I have a good excuse. It's the deficit. <laughs> So Dasha, just that you know, cumin is curry now for the next days. And Dasha, what should we make the thumbnail about? If you want, I can vlog for what? you. What? Hi guys, how are you doing? So as, as you see, Ferdinand is kind of busy today, so I'm going to take over. So what should we do? I just said I closed it. <laughs> <laughs> okay go. guys, that's it for today. But what is the vlog about before you close it? Okay, so what is it about? Go out, give a homeless guy 2,000 euro, and then it's a good thumbnail. Take your own money, though. Okay, but first I have to find the homeless guy. You got this. <laughs> there are plenty in Berlin. Okay. Actually, not that much. Many. Here we go. Um, yeah, awkward moment. I don't know. You got this. Finish the vlog. It's all yours. I just make my dinner. What did you do? Where did you what? stop the shop? What? No! Close the vlog! It's just about something. The day was just what it was. That's daily vlogging. It's raw, it's authentic. I don't need to make something. The day just was what it was and that's the day and I see you here. Continue! And I see you and Ferdinand will see you precisely tomorrow because he vlogs every single day. And peace, eat your chickpeas and bye! Out. Out.